gentlemen, welcome back to the Tidwell Taste Tour. Thanks for joining us. This episode, uh, yeah. glad everybody's here today. Yeah. We have, right. a, uh, so we, have a, we have a so we have a second time guest, but the first videos have still not been posted from January. <laughs> <laughs> so, so for those that don't know, this is the sibling of this one. Hello. And another Eric. <laughs> and another Eric. Yeah. Hey, another Eric. Of course, I guess my real name is James anyway. Concerns. So, anyway. Is everybody ready to tour? Uh -huh. All right. This is the Lion Kugels uh, Watermelon Shandy, a mix of vice beer with a hint of watermelon flavor for a taste made for summer. Let's see, 4.2% alcohol by volume, like pretty much everyone they do is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Vice beer brewed with honey and natural flavors added. Yeah, this was the only new one in the mix pack, sadly. It came with ginger. Ginger, summer, lemon. which is just lemon. Yeah. Which is good. The lemon ones, I think, just called some. Oh, grapefruit. Was the I, they're grapefruit, yeah. It's very grapefruity. Very. Ah. <laughs> but a, a, little, a little... A little too grapefruit. Too, well, the thing is, is it's like the tart grapefruit versus like yeah. the sweet. Yeah. Prefer yeah. that, uh... The elusive. Oh, yeah, the traveler oh, grapefruit. Yeah. That's what's up. Oh, yeah, that is good. Yeah. Anyways. Watermelon cherry. I'm not like I could pour a little more. I'm not sure on the proportions, obviously, because... We all got different glasses, now it's five, not four, blah, blah, blah. Anywho, it looks like this one worked out just fine. Yeah. All right, let's try watermelon sh shandy from Line and Kugels. Oh, wow. Very watermelon -y. Yeah. Really? That's a good point. Mm -hmm. I agree with that. Here's what's weird. It doesn't smell that watermelon -y. Right. When you taste it, well, yeah. immediately it's I feel like anything watermelon... <laughs> watermelon flavored, if you're trying... <laughs> it, that's great. That's what we taste it. Taste. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. To the taste store here. Taste. Where the reviewers can't taste. <laughs> I assume it tastes watermelon. <laughs> that's According to this description. <laughs> so, well, I guess you're not rating this. I, I can't. Okay, uh, well, in that case, <laughs> she's a, a shot. Yeah, so we'll clear that'll clear her out. Around. We'll get her a shot off the uh, camera. <laughs> but yeah, it w I think when you're trying to make watermelon, like natural watermelon, instead of sort of a Jolly Rancher candy type watermelon, it's going to be hard to make it very obvious. And yeah, but, but I think this is a good job of it. It is kind of more of a natural watermelon yeah, flavor. It is. It's the Jolly Rancher issue. There's a little bit yeah. of it. Yeah. <laughs> it does. It, it does. But it's all like he's those. Uh, he's those right about the technical terminology, but. Well, because we've had what we've had some other watermelons. So like we had the Mike's watermelon that's like super oh, God. super oh, yeah. jolly ranchery. Yeah. And this is like beer. Like if you drank a glass of beer with a slice of water. You almost yeah. have to because uh, it's good. watermelon juice isn't really a thing. I mean, right, so I water, guess it's a water. thing. Maybe it's water. It's exactly. Yeah. 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 The, the interesting, so pretty much any type of shandy that Lightning Kugels does, it's always, they're always good. Yeah. They're always solid. Mm -hmm. um, I happen to love watermelon as a flavor and as a, a fruit. I like it too, but normally I don't, I would, I'll tell you right now, if I saw this normally, I, I think I would order the regular lemon one first and many other ones, the grapefruit one first and all that. Until I, really, I tasted this, then I don't know that I would. Right. Yeah. Like it, if I just saw it, I mean, if I hadn't mm -hmm. already tasted mm -hmm. it, that's what I meant. If I just saw the tap handles and I saw all these different shandies, right, I picked right. all of those before the, a watermelon. But after tasting it, this is a really good job at. It exemplifies summer like really well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. It's very summery. Could could easily fuck it up, you know? <laughs> yeah. You could right. easily. You would think this. It would probably just be a more watery right. shandy. You know what I mean? This could have easily gone wrong. It seems like, but yeah. it's really good. It's I'm really actually gonna hit it with a. Uh, I don't know if anyone else is doing at least on a large scale yeah. doing a watermelon shandy. I'm sure, somebody somewhere is. Yeah. What was the fat tire one? It wasn't a shandy, right? No, no that was a watermelon. Just, yeah. just a lot. Ale or like, right. I think it was. I think it was an ale. Maybe. Yeah. yeah. It was like the. Heavy metal, but yeah, definitely not a not a shandy. Heavy yeah. melon. Heavy melon, yeah. yeah. Trying, they were trying to do a pun. Didn't really work. It, it was stupid. Um, <laughs> this is like an eight and a half. For me. Yeah, I'm gonna give it an eight and a half. I'm gonna I have like that. Set. It's good. Ditto. Eight and a half. I'm gonna go with a nine. Uh, All right. Yeah. How about you? I'll just I'll just water <laughs> <on there. laughs> I Maybe you'll be steering clear of this one. Yeah. yeah, we'll get her a shot off camera. Get all that uh, yeah. mucus yeah, broken up. 
some inner, Or a shot uh, up her nose or something. Yeah. I don't know what's going to need to happen. You got some butter popcorn over there. Do you like looking at <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's your punishment for not being able to taste. <laughs> 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 yeah. I still want to this is the first NA in taste the work. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Well, so a nine and a trio of eight and a half. Alright, anything else oh, yeah. to add? Ah, Tasty, pretty good. Get it. I would check it out. Just yeah, I would too. If you like, I, I'll sum it up like this. If you like watermelon at all, definitely try it. If you like any of the the uh, fruit style shandies that they do, it's worth a shot. For sure. Oh, yeah. If you like them, it's definitely worth a shot. And I don't think you'll be disappointed. And you could drink a bunch of these. Yeah, totally. Okay. So with that said, especially at 4.2%. Yeah. Yeah. So with that said, Line and Kugel's Watermelon Shandy, 4.2%. They're vice beer and watermelon. Taste Store will return. We thank you for joining us. It's been a trio of eight and a half and a nine. And it's been a pleasure being with you. Join us again.